Alright, welcome back. Today we're going to learn how to draw a rhombus. A rhombus is a four-sided figure with four sides equal. Okay, once again, we shall start with how to set our compass. First, we put our compass on a level ground. Then we put our pencil through. Then we tighten the nut. Okay, then we're good to go. First, let's construct line PQ. 5 centimeter line. Right? We shall mark out 0 to 5. Okay? Once we have done that, we shall label it P Q 5 CM. Next, we'll mark out angle P, which is 110 degrees. Angle P is over here. We'll put our protractor on the line. Okay. From the zero marking, we shall count 110 degrees. So it's 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80, 90, 100, 110. So put a marking over here. Okay. We shall draw a line from the marking to P. Next, we'll open our compass to 5 centimeters. So let's use this part here. 0 to 5. Okay, double check. 0 to 5. Okay. And then we put the needle at point P. We mark out. Right now, this point here would be point S. All right. So next, P Q. We want to find another angle. In this case, we do not mark out 110. We we'll mark out 110, 180. Sorry, minus 110, which is 70 degrees. We we'll mark out a 70 degree angle at point Q. Similarly, we put our protractor at point Q. Mark out a 70 degree angle. 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70. Mark it out. Take our ruler. Draw a line. All right. Now, if we have not moved our compass, it should still be 5 centimeters wide, but we shall check it. Yes, it's still 5 centimeters. Put the needle at Q. Mark our point. This will be our point R. Okay, this is not a rhombus yet. In order to make it a rhombus, we need to close it up. So the intersection here at point R will meet the intersection here at point S and we join it. All right. So now P Q R S is a rhombus. Okay, and we still have to add in the labeling. So finally, angle P is 110. We shall label 110 degrees. Since a rhombus has four equal sides. We should label 5 cm, 5 cm, and 5 cm. And that's how you construct a rhombus. Thank you.